one of our dogs, Bob, is an old English sheepdog. One of the things that makes this breed so special is their extremely enthusiastic nature. Bob wants to be part of everything I do outside. He follows me around everywhere and carefully watches over my feeding routine. He seems to like his supervisory role and gets to hoover up any leftover crumbs. Our other dog, Annie, loves to distract him, but he's not having it. This breed is well known for their herding instinct, which Bob unfortunately has not inherited. Yeah, Bob, breakfast time now? Never mind, he deserves his own breakfast anyhow. Bob is getting a bit old now and can't quite keep up anymore with us on the roads. He also is almost deaf, so he rides along with me on the gig. Bob always chooses following me around over lying in the sun. After all, he could miss out on something exciting like manure spreading. Of course, this breed is also known for their long shaggy coat. They don't molt. So when the weather gets warmer, they can get extremely hot. There's only one solution. You need a haircut, Bob. I use surgical scissors as well as sheep shears. I find it works best to start with the easy long hair at the top. Then I work my way along the back. Along the legs, the hair can get very matted and turn into rasta locks. I often have to cut one strand of felted hair at the time. I use the scissors for the most difficult places, as well as around his face. Bob is very good-natured and extremely patient. It can take up to two hours to cut his hair. So, after a while, we both get a bit tired. Time for lie down. Only the four legs left now. Final touches. And back to work. And not only Bob feels better now, the chaffinches are happy too. <laughs>